junior doctors in England are taking part in a fourth walkout in their long-running contract dispute. The 48-hour strike started at 8 o'clock BST as the doctors prepare legal challenges to the government's decision to impose changes to their pay and conditions from this summer. Doctors are again providing emergency cover, but 5,000 operations and procedures have been postponed. NHS England said the continued disruption was deeply regrettable. The latest action means the total number of treatments that have been delayed has now hit 24,500 during the dispute. The Patients Association has come out in support of junior doctors despite the disruption, saying the government should not be imposing the contract. But despite pleas from them and other organisations for both sides to get back around the negotiating table, the government and British Medical Association, BMA, have remained adamant they will not budge from their positions. Sources indicated there was now little dialogue between ministers and the union with the first ever walkouts of emergency care in the history of the NHS planned for the end of April. The all-out stoppages will take place from 8 o'clock to 1700 hours BST on both 26 and the 27th of April and will see junior doctors refuse to staff A&E departments as well as emergency surgery and intensive care. The BMA said it had been left with no choice in its fight against the government's plan to impose a new contract in which, it said, the profession had no confidence. Ministers have said the changes which will see doctors paid less for working weekends while basic pay is increased, are needed to improve care at weekends. This is disputed by the BMA.